If you're watching this video, you've probably played or seen some of the top Pokemon ROM hacks out there. But you might not know that some of the coolest hacks out there are a little less known. Last week on stream, I got to play a ROM hack called Project Space Taker. Developed by Osohi oh Ghost. I don't exactly know how to pronounce that, I apologize. For MAGM6, a competition by Anthroid focused on making a playable game confined to one area. I love MAGM because it forces hackers to think outside the box and come up with a really unique and creative storyline that works within the confines of never leaving one area. If you want to see more of these ROM hacks or want to check out the competition, the link to Anthroid's Discord is in the description. Right next to the subscribe button, which you should probably hit. I mean, it takes, what, like no effort clicking a button? Come on, fellas. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to Project Space Taker. This game is my submission to Anthroid's MAGM 6 Game Jam. This is what we call Pokemon. This game is segmented into seven in-game days. Make sure to explore all you can during each day. It's kind of like Majora's Mask. You are? I'm a girl! I'm Chris. It is Chris! What is this? What are you? There's a basement? There's leftovers in the trash? This game's already fantastic! Uh oh. Oh, Chris! I found something! If you're gonna help study this island, you're gonna need a Pokémon. But I can't really show you. Follow me. How do I use this dang old contraption? I haven't used one of these since college. It's a beer bong! I knew you would be needing a very powerful Pokémon. One that would be able to protect you from any unknown danger. We get Aerodactyl! That's a dope starter. Check everything, even the cardboard boxes. On new days, check them again. What are we naming Aerodactyl, chat? F13. That's kind of goaded. I'm gonna do F13. If you ever find a fossil, you can revive it here at any time. If you need to heal your, heal your Pokemon, use the machine behind you. It's about time you get to know and explore Lumiere Island. Nothing too unusual should happen yet. I've had enough of the outdoors today. I'm sick of grass. Whenever you're ready to sleep, you can use the bed downstairs. One last thing. The sheets are disgusting. Ooh. Okay. All right. It keeps coming. All right, all right, all right. What's up here? I really like the mapping. It's got a crazy mix of uh, Safari Zone, Emerald Trees, Fire Red Trees, Fire Red Rock, Fire Red Grass, Sideways Stairs. You love to see it. Some puddles. A cave. We could get Raichu. And that's it. Let's keep exploring. There's rock climb. Also, the rock climb tiles look great. Crustle looks like lasagna. Should I get Floatzel? What are we naming Floatzel? We got the Floatzel. Goatzel. Hot dog. Let's do Goatzel. If I can evolve Scyther, I'll catch it. 1000%. On God. You can get a Metal Coat later. We're catching it. We're for sure catching it. Scyther like gotta be in my top 10 favorite Pokemon. Scizor's my number one fighting. It seems really cool so far. Like the idea of having seven days and uh, having to do different stuff each day. That's very cool. Can you name a Pokemon a Goofy Movie? There you go, Carson. Goofy Movie. Maybe there's nothing on day one. Sorry, I gotta answer my email. You can rest until tomorrow. All right, let's rest. Let's take a nap. All right, we have six days left now. This is day two of seven. The TV is set to a news channel. Reports of Mirage Islands continue. Memorial Pillar off the coast of Five Island has disappeared. Its location is unknown. We get 10 more great balls. Oh, there's a rock. <gasps> Something different. Ew. I fucking hate Parasect. I can't stand Parasect. I'm gonna kill it. I'm gonna one hit it because it sucks. I hate Parasect. Get out of here! Bye! Goodbye! Bye bye! Strength! Good! Alright, you're gonna one hit it too. Goodbye. Is that my nut? Cause that's bussin'. Beedrill? Automatically. Beedrill. Beedrill it is. What is this? Beware? Why did it sound like a fart? Why does its cry sound like a fart? It sounded like a stomach growling while you were farting. Ooh, wait, this is new. This is new. It's Memorial Pillar from Fire Red. This was the Mirage Island that disappeared. Yo! 
We can get Scizor! Oh, because it's it's on that island in Fire Red, I get it. Oh my god, he's so cool. Can we get- Members, can we get Scizor emote in chat? Let's go, fellas. Let's go. Fellas, there's no shot I don't catch this. Unless I kill it right here on accident. Uh, I don't want Onyx. You're literally hanging out around your dead cousin, dude. That's weird. Skip. Potato. Glop. Ugh. Oh, I bet this goes right here. We're gonna do that after we heal. F13 use strength. Ooh. A bit of a puzzle. This is a cool ROM hack. This is very cool. That one is up in the top left. It's on the bridge. It goes to the memorial pillar. Pinsir is probably one of the scariest Pokemon if you see this like in real life. That is probably one of the scariest Pokemon to see. Imagine waking up and seeing that thing on the floor. Imagine it like wriggling around. Also, where does this one go? Oh. What? I'm glad you're safe. I felt a tremor and came running. The island has disappeared. Come back to the lab. All right. You're a bit of a weirdo, but I like you. I think he's the true Redditor. I think perhaps we get to the end of the ROM and we battle him and it's like Redditor Cygnus. But island you must- you found must be a memorial pillar. Whatever you did with the stones must have returned the island. You should get some rest. Probably. The TV set to a news channel. Reports of Mirage Islands continue. Johto region's Whirl Islands have had multiple pieces of land disappear and reappear throughout the night. Are we gonna find Lugia? I bet the Whirl Islands are down here, kind of like, uh, yeah, like the last island. Oh, we're gonna need Surf. Um, there is, there's stairs. I bet that's Surf and it lets you go across that pond. A Dawnstone, hey. Rock climb, wasn't surf. All right. New area. Is there anything in this rock? Is there any rare Pokemon in here? A squid. I don't like the squid. I gotta appreciate the custom sprites too, to include those uh, when you're on a contest deadline. Because doing custom sprites is a lot of sprites. You have to have fishing, you have to have uh, Using items, you have to have flight. We don't have a fishing rod, do we? I love, because they added like stuff changing every day, it makes you really want to explore everything. It really makes you want to explore. Let's look at the World Islands again. Oh shit! There's a sideways, I didn't even notice. We didn't need surf. I wonder if we'll find Lugia. <gasps> Thirty-five, that's not bad. We can deal with that. Alright, I'll throw a ball. Oh lord. Oh. We all know the trick is to mash the B button. So that's what we're gonna do. Maybe it's not. Oy vey. We got it! <laughs> oh, thank god. Let's do it after Shao's mom. Maggie. Oh, the professor didn't even care this time. Absolutely, we, I absolutely, I think I just had a stroke. I absolutely love this character sprite. I agree, this character sprite's awesome. I feel like we got everything for the day, right? No shot we missed anything. It just farts every time. What do you got today, old man? I should have known I wouldn't find any good ideas on the internet. The people on this website are crazy. You know what to do. What, is he telling me to threaten them? Pacifilog Town. Interesting. Chris loves my mom, but you guys should hear about what he says about his own mom. I did this joke for a while, 
Where if anyone brought my mom up, I'd be like, yeah, dude, my mom's so hot. Damn, my mom's so hot. And I think people started taking it seriously. I bet Pacific Log Town is right here. Wait. This is the actual Mirage Island, isn't it? Yeah, this is just a legit Mirage Island. Oh no, it has Shadow Tag. Is that May? Brendan, there's a strange berry tree over here. We found this berry first. I know, we should have a Pokemon battle to settle it. That was a quick jump. Who said I even wanted the berry? I never said anything. It's a double battle. That's kind of sick. That's kind of dope. Oh no. We outspeed the camera up. Goatzel, let's go. Don't get confused, Goatzel. Fuck. Swampert's a bit scary. Um. Ooh. Matter of fact, let's try to take out the Pelipper. I feel like that's more important. Oh, it's Mega! Ooh! If it's Mega Swampert and Mega Blaziken, that's gonna be really bad. Don't take out Goofy, you bastard. Get the boost. Yes! Don't attack F13 Pelipper. Go for Skip Tato. Use Hurricane. Because we might outspeed. Never mind. Get the boost again. Get the boost again. God damn it. This hack has a bug where the Brendan May NPCs show up on a later day. Ignore them. That's a reset. I'll do 10 push ups. We can get Mega Scizor. And we can get Armaldo. Jump Bluff! Like this. Where in the world did you find a Mega Ring? Aerodactylite. Okay, so we j it just has to be Aerodactyl. We can plan now because we know what they're gonna have. It's gonna be Camera Ups who gets killed by Goatzel. I feel like it's worth doing this. Even though we're still under leveled. I say we Mega Evolve, hit it with an Ancient Power just to try it, and we take out this thing in one hit. Alright, there's a start. It survived? Don't use Rock Slide, please. Get the boost. You're an idiot. Holy shit, that did a lot. No! Why is it faster than Aerodactyl? How is it faster? Good. Sceptile. Okay, that's better. We don't have Speed Swampert though, which is crazy. That is crazy to me. This fight is tough. I mean, Sceptile went down in one hit, that's good, but... I say we don't put Skip Bloom in yet, because he's gonna go for a rock slide if we do. I think we're better off, like, making it want to hit Beedrill with Waterfall or use Earthquake. Good. I wonder if they would have Megaed the Sceptile if he used Pelipper first, if you KO'd it first. I think it, they would have. I think they would have. It is a good challenge. It is the first battle of the game, and it's a good challenge. Give me the berry! I want the berry! It is a lychee berry! I feel like that's the only thing, right? Like, we already explored the island, so we got we should probably go to the next day. Anything in the trash today? Nope. What's on TV today? A small section of Sinnoh's Iron Island has disappeared. Workers at the mine are unharmed, however, the sudden disappearance of the land has flooded the island, rendering the mine inaccessible. Okay. Are we gonna get a Lucario? Ooh, don't want to go that way. We get stuck, maybe. Let's explore first. <laughs> I hate its cry so much. Oh, it's just a fart. Ah, uh, cave. What's new in the cave? The cave of free things. Hmm. Stairs. What's this? Dig! We already have a Pokemon with Dig. I guess we just send it to Iron Island, huh? And we can use Dig if we get stuck? Is that the idea? Fuck it. 
Oh, is that the glitch you were talking about? Which MAGM is this from? This is the winner from number six. Ooh, we got the Reggie music. Let's see what's in here too. It is Lucario. Hey! Do we want Gibble even though it's level 26? Probably not. Sick. <laughs> Worth. Level 40! Oh! Okay. There we go. Okay. Alright. Name it Nutsario. <laughs> look, 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 look. If you're gonna slap nuts into something, fellas, you gotta make it clever. You can't just throw nuts in there. It's just not right. You can't just stick your nuts in things. Young gravy, baby. Lucario left behind Lucario Knight. Hey, another Mega Evolution. Um, I'm not sure if there's anything else though. Nothing of note on this island, huh? However, you did battle an extremely powerful dog. We have to find an answer. Get some sleep, I'm sure you'll need it for tomorrow. Alright, bud. You're gonna tell me what to do. What's on TV? Radio connection to a boat traveling from Castelia City to Liberty Garden in the Nova region has been lost. Travel logs say approximately 11 people were on the boat? Uh-oh. Is there gonna be 11 battles? What's the fossil today, fellas? Plume fossil. Hmm. Archeops. 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 Arch 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 oh, shit. Wait, did the whole town end up here? What the hell? There are trainers inside Liberty Garden that won't leave. My son won't leave Liberty Garden until you battle him. What a weird son. Make sure you have- you're ready to have a battle. You have to beat them in a row? Ooh. Heh <laughs> weirdos! Is that Daisy? Jumpluff is our bravest soldier. Fought the hardest battles. Won the hardest battles. Beat Brendan Swampert. Zeb Stryka. We're fine. We mega evolve, we use Bone Rush. Easy. Always our starting move. Works every time. Jump Bluff is the box legendary for this round. Like a charm, baby. Easy. It's your time to shine, baby. Show them the best Pokemon in the game. Look at it, it's unstoppable. Didn't take a scratch of damage. Next is some old man. To settle a disagreement, what are you disagreeing about? Skip Tato is seriously just unkillable. Unstoppable, unshakable, unquakeable. Bug types are generally weak all around. Yeah. I think the typing is better than ice, but typically bug Pokemon stink. I give them the benefit of the doubt, though, because of Scizor. Whoa, he's red! Hey, kid. Thanks for helping force those trainers off the island. I found this stone. It's a rock. Palkia. Uh-oh. Is Day 7 in Palkia? This is quite a strange island. Why are you up here? How are you gonna get down? I saw your team, you can't get down. There you are. I didn't expect a bunch of stubborn dumbasses to come visit this place. If it weren't for you, I think we wouldn't... I don't think we'd be able to get him back home. I think you would. I think if you called the police, that would have worked. The captain gave you a rock? You know what this is, correct? It's a rock. It was a rock on the Liberty Garden. That means my theories were correct. There are rocks at Liberty Garden. That must be how these islands can appear and disappear in the blink of an eye. I have a feeling tomorrow's the big day. Check the TV. At least I'm on the news. Hey! Connection has been made with Professor Cygnus on Lumiere Island. All missing passengers have been found by me! A team of sailors from Castelia City have been sent to escort the passengers. Sick. Fellas, let's do day seven, the final day. Go, Chris, you have to find and stop Palkia. 
How does he know Palkia is here? I just assume? The previously thought to be extinct Pokemon Cleaver has been spotted near Eterna Forest, Forest and Sinnoh. Okay. Does that mean Cleaver's here? Can we get rock, paper, and scissors in this run? We're in the cave. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alright, I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save. Hopefully that doesn't uh, softlock me or anything. What do I do? Did, it, did I actually softlock? Or did the counter change? Oh, I can use dig, can't I? What happens if I use dig? Yes. Okay. Uh-oh. Is he gonna get rid of the lab? You bastard! <laughs> he just killed him! <laughs> he just fucking killed him! Oh lord. I hope this doesn't soft block me. Oh no! Okay, new cave, new cave, new cave, fellas, new cave! Whoa. What's back here? I bet there's something. Let's go this way. Oh, it's a loop, I bet. That's cool. That's really cool, actually. Let's fuck it up. Let's go, Young Gravy. Yes! Oh, we did it. Let's go, we got the big dumb dragon. What do we name it? The most important nickname of the run, Palky Poo. <laughs> and there it is, Dialga, the uh, legendary this game was sent to someone's PC. And we're back. There's a QR code on the computer. Hey, yo. There it is. Fellas, Rankomon who I believe was in chat earlier, did the sprites. It was designed and credited by Oh So He Ghost. I don't know how to pronounce that. Bunch of wonderful people, though. That was a lot of fun. That was a ton of fun. What do you have to say, guy? Hey, Chris. Do you want to hear a message from the creator? Too bad you don't get a choice. It's me. I don't know how to pronounce your name, Oh So He Ghost. If you're reading this, I hope you like this goofy little project of mine. Before anything else, I want to give a huge thanks to Ranko, the guy in chat. Right there! For helping out with the player sprites in this project. Not only that... Oh, she, I'm sorry. I, I, I automatically went for boy. My bad. So much good advice and feedback. She taught me a lot about what it takes to design a game like this. Also, thanks to Valen, Snugboat, and Nick for beta testing. I apologize to you all for being a little bundle of stress over the past month while working on this project. I know it's not perfect and it's messy at times, but I'm so glad I decided to actually follow through with entering MAGM6. Again, I cannot thank you all enough for playing this. That's fantastic. That rocks. There are no girls on the internet. <laughs> True. I'm so used to uh, this channel having like a, what, 5% girl viewer base? <laughs> I don't expect it. But that is Space Taker. But fellas, I'm gonna hang out a little bit longer, but it is getting kind of late. 